Enter the world of Arab kids, born into a life of privilege and excess, where having a private yacht, a fleet of automobiles, and a wardrobe fit for royalty is the standard. Follow the next generation of trillionaires as they negotiate their opulent lifestyles, surrounded by unbelievable wealth, but also the expectations and obligations that come with it. Explore their opulent world and learn about the difficulties they confront in retaining their money and status in the fast-paced and competitive world of the super-rich. The Trillionaire Life of Arab Kids is a narrative about power, wealth, and success pressure. If you're new here, click the subscribe button and then the bell icon to get instant notifications of new videos. Let's get started. He was born on May 8, 2003. He is the apparent heir to the Moroccan monarchy. He is the eldest son of Morocco's King Mohammed VI and Princess Lala Salma. He's named after his grandpa, Hassan II, and has a younger sister, Princess Lala Khadija. Princess Moulay Hassan, the 19-year-old heir to a trillion-dollar fortune, lives the life of a king. Morocco's crown prince, Malay Hassan, was given one of the market's most expensive and powerful commercial airplanes. The Gulfstream G650 plane received by Malay Hassan is one of the best modern aircraft and costs $64 million. The jet is fully customized down to the registration plate CNAMH, which stands for Altesse Majesty Malay Hassan. The VIP jet can travel up to 14,000 kilometers non-stop while carrying up to eight passengers and four crew members. The Israeli J-Music missile defense system fitted on board, which is said to cost $20 million, made the craft more expensive than typical commercial airplanes. Despite his youth, he is a successful businessman with an eye for investing and a drive for invention. Despite his luxurious lifestyle, Prince Malay is a philanthropist who uses his fortune to help communities worldwide. However, with great money comes tremendous responsibility, and Prince Malay is under pressure to live up to his family's expectations and continue to build their fortune. The trillionaire life of Prince Malay Hassan is a story about luxury, power, and the difficulties of being a young member of the super-rich. Malay Hassan is one of the world's wealthiest kids. Hashem bin Abdullah, Prince of Saudi Arabia, on January 30th, 2005, at the age of 17, King Abdullah II of Jordan and his wife, Queen Rania, welcomed their fourth child and second son, Prince Hussein Hashem, who is named after lineage of the Islamic prophet Muhammad, the Hashemite family. He is a direct descendant of the Prophet, specifically the 42nd generation, unlike his brother, the Crown Prince Hashem. The prince shares the same birthday as his father, the King of Jordan. As the family's last child, he does not make many royal appearances, but as he approaches his adolescent years, this is set to change, and he will be seen more frequently with his father and brother. Hashem was born at King Hussein Medical Center, Amman, named after his father, and now there is a hospital named after him as well, the Prince Hashem bin Abdullah Hospital, Aqaba. He is growing into a fine gentleman and is currently invested in his academic studies. He already has a legacy for him, as his royal family appears to be down to earth and not overly entrenched in the nuances of royalty. Prince Abdul Wahid is 16 years old. The prince was born on June 16, 2006 to his father, Brunei Sultan, and Yangdi, Pertwan, Hassano, Bokia ibn Omar Ali, Saifuddin III, one of the world's richest men, with an estimated net worth of $20 billion. Mazar Hakim is Asrina's mother. Prince Wakil was born into luxury. To fully explain this, we must first examine his father's possessions. The Sultan of Brunei is reported to have the world's greatest private luxury car collection with approximately 7,000 vehicles valued at more than $5 billion. Think of all the luxury cars in the world, and the Sultan of Brunei is likely to have them all in his garage, from Ferraris to Mercedes-Benz and Rolls Royces. He also has a diverse collection of custom-made vehicles. The Sultan's private jet, also known as the Flying Palace, may appear to be an ordinary airliner from the outside, but once on board, you are in for a frightening encounter. The airplane costs more than $200 million for its purchase and the special refurbishments done inside. It has different compartments fully plated with gold, including a bedroom and a sitting room. These cars and jets are available to Sultan's sons, and his elder sons have taken his love for luxury. 
Prince Abdul Mateen has an exotic collection of animals, including rare white tigers. His eldest son and heir to the throne, Prince Abdul Malik, had a lavish wedding that lasted 10 days and drew over 6,000 guests from all over the world, including members of royalty and political dignitaries. However, young Abdul Wakil has remained low-key, focusing on his academics as he grows into a fine young man. Prince Rashid Balhasa is not, in fact, a prince. He is the millionaire and multinational business tycoon Saif Ahmed Balhasa's youngest son. Sara Mohammed Rashid Abdullah is his mother's name. Despite being born into one of the wealthiest families in the UAE, he is a well-known YouTuber. His net worth is $2 billion. He manages the popular Money Kicks YouTube channel. His monthly earnings from his YouTube channel are $8,000 US dollars. His most popular YouTube videos are from his Sneaker Talk series, which includes Wiz Khalifa, Tiger, The Game, Salento, and Kid Inc. He collects expensive automobiles and owns nearly every expensive and unusual car worldwide. His shoe and watch collection rivals that of a shopping mall. He owns a large, attractive, and costly property in Dubai. His family's rural house is reminiscent of an animal refuge. He has a clothing company called Streetwear Line KA1 and a bag brand called Sprayground. He has a fantastic fortune in luxury cars, Rolls-Royce, Range Rover, Mercedes-Benz, AMG GTS, Audi R8, Lamborghini Aventador, Ferrari F12, Porsche 91A, Limousine Classic Mercedes, Nissan Patrols, and Infiniti Cadillac Escalade. Instagram influencer Mohammed bin Ahmed Jabbar Al Harbi was born on October 9th, 2016 in the United Arab Emirates. His large Instagram page, which shows photographs of his daily life, has made him a social media star. His parents maintain his account, which has over 650,000 followers on social networking. He won the nation's heart at the Derby when he gently removed his top hat and approached the Queen for a handshake. But rubbing elbows with royalty is nothing new for Muhammad bin Ahmed Jabbar Al Harbi. The four or five year old child is the son of Ahmed Jabbar Al Harbi, a close friend of Dubai's Crown Prince Hamdan. As a result, the boy whose royal encounter at Epsom Racecourse went viral online spends much of his time flying around the world with his father and the 32 year old Emirati prince in a private jet. Indeed, the prince, whose full name is Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, uploaded a photo of the small boy's visit with the British monarch on Instagram, with the caption, Nothing demonstrates respect more than a proper handshake. Keen lovers of horse racing on the flat, Mohammed and Prince Hamdan arrived at Royal Ascot by helicopter last year with the words, This is Mohammed, my best buddy. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe to the channel, like the video, and share your thoughts and questions in the comment section. And as always, I'll see you again very soon.